Hey, what is up guys? This is Camstrony5. Welcome back to another Ark Survival Evolved mobile video. Boom! Yes, peeps, we are back for another episode of Scorched Dark, where we cannot be out and about during the day. Only at night is when we can do activities and yeah, go out out of our base. Alright, so today, like I said, we're gonna prep up for a dungeon, and that's when this series will end in after we do a dungeon. Alrighty, so uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get all the items needed for the dungeons. I'm gonna show you where to get the Ascendant Pump, Ascendant Carbon Bow, and a full set of flak, alright? But first, in order to go and get those things, this is what you would need. Okay, so first of all, you'll need a super high leveled die off probably max level right because you need that to go into the cave okay once you get that gonna go ahead to chitin cave i'll i'll put a little video at the background here um you can see we did the chitin cave where you can get a full set of chitin all right uh once you get that we can do the terror bird hunt you can't do that before or even after whichever comes first do the terror bird hunt to get ascendant sword all right so once you got those things then you go ahead to do the skylord cave now that will give you full set of ascended flak if you continue to grind it as i did you will see and uh, that one you don't really need that much just the full set of chitin um, which you'll get enough resources in the chitin cave to craft chitin armor and obviously your ascendant sword from the terror bird hunt. Yeah, and that's all the goodies we got from the Sky Lord cave. It's amazing. Look at that crazy freaking ascendant flak gear we got from it. It costs a lot, but we'll manage to craft it. And then going to the Yeti cave, the strong cave, um, you will need either, well, if you can, if you if you have the means already, you don't have to worry. But if you do want, you can get a spider. If that works on multiplayer, I'm not entirely sure. I guess I would try it out soon. Yeah, you can use a spider. If not, go ahead with your max level die wolf. Remember to level it up as much as you can before you go to that cave. Probably get it over 10k health like this one. And yeah, you can just speed run it. You can also speed run it on foot. But uh, yeah, it's kind of tricky for that. <laughs> Don't attempt it if you're not confident enough. Right, and then go ahead and run the cave. 
And yeah, get okay, all the juicy loots that uh, you'll see when I finish run this Yeti cave. Oh, oh, one more thing before you go to the Yeti cave. Um, to control your temperature, you'd also need to tame an otter because that's going to help you in the cave. If you don't have that, well, craft a full set of fur, but you wouldn't need it if you got a full ascended chitin gear and an otter. Alrighty. Alrighty, peeps, there we go. We've got everything that we needed. We got a compound bow, which is 1085. We've got a full ascendant flak, alright, and then we've got the pump shotgun, which is 240. Um, the last hard mode I had was um, 256, but 240 will give it a try. If not, I will come back and rebrand the cave. But uh, this was just to show you guys where you need to go, and uh, yeah where you get it and how you get it alrighty um 
Except for easy, probably you'll get Mastercraft, but for medium and upwards, you'll get um, Ascendant. Alright, there is a chance, I think, for easy to get my Ascendant. I'm not entirely sure. Alrighty. But yeah, that is it from me today, guys. Thank you so much for coming in and watching the video. Hopefully, you enjoyed. And if you did, smash the thumbs up button. And if you're new to the channel, subscribe for more content. Also, remember to click the bell icon to catch every single video that I upload. This is Cam25 signing out. Peace.